एथिकल हैकिंग समझाओ एथिकल हैकिंग ये होती है कि जैसे इट्स समथिंग लाइक वी हैक ऑर्गेनाइजेशन वी टेस्ट देयर सिक्योरिटी एंड वी डोंट मिसयूज दैट इंफॉर्मेशन हम उनको बताते हैं एंड वी हेल्प देम सिक्योर देमसेल्फ फ्रॉम द रियल अटैकर्स दैट आर आउट देयर माइंड सेट सेम होता है अच्छा लेकिन जो तरीके होते हैं वो डिफरेंट होते हैं इन टर्म्स वी डोंट वी नॉट देयर टू स्टील देयर इंफॉर्मेशन और देयर मनी और देयर टू हेल्प देम सिक्योर देमसेल्फ ताकि कोई और आके एक्सप्लॉयट नहीं कर लेट्स इट्स मोर लाइक It's more like we're the good guys in cyber security. We have accomplished. Okay, and you were number third. Yeah, most accomplished. accomplished person. Most, yeah, most accomplished bug bounty hunter. And how do we validate that? Lo, आपको पता है ना पाकिस्तान में लोग कहते हैं. Ah, you can well. There is an organization called Dark Lady. Uh, every five years or three years, it does a survey, a check on people, and it it validates their findings or the research को वो. उनके साइड से गो थ्रू करते हैं वैलिडेट्स व्हाट हैव दे डन हाउ दे डन एंड रोल्स के बाद दे पब्लिश अ रिपोर्ट उसमें टॉप 10 अ बग बाउंटी हंटर्स स्लैश एथिकल हैकर्स जो रैंकिंग देते हैं तो ओके करंटली आई एम द थर्ड ओके ग्रेट साउंड्स ग्रेट यू वर जस्ट टॉकिंग अबाउट बिकॉज़ वी आर बिल्डिंग कंटेंट ऑन विमेन एंटरप्रेन्योरशिप एंड फीमेल फाउंडर्स एंड देयर चैलेंजेस सो अभी आप मुझे बता रहे थे कि एथिकल हैकिंग क्यों जरूरी है और साइबर सिक्योरिटी क्यों इम्पोर्टेंट है फॉर वुमेन सो लेट्स कम बैक टू दैट व्हाई इज इट इम्पोर्टेंट फेसबुक हैकिंग से लेके बिजनेस इश्यूज तक वेयर डज द इश्यू स्टार्ट वेल आप यू नो द थिंग इज दैट मोर यू नो वी सी वुमेन गोइंग इनटू बिजनेस मोर एंड मोर एवरी डे एंड देयर देयर सॉर्ट ऑफ गोइंग फ्रॉम मार्केट वैलिडेटर्स टू मार्केट लीडर्स राइट नाउ Right. And the awareness regarding cyber security in women is next to zero. I don't know that if they if they are going to lead an organization in the future, they need to know uh, the business side as well as the security side because your business uh, is as good as it is secure. Right. If, if it's not secure, you're you're going to lose a lot of money, a lot of reputation, blah blah blah. So how how do you help them secure? Them? Well, it's it's it it's back to the basics. Mm-hmm. First of all, it's it's about securing your online presence. Mm-hmm. Only महीने में किसी को ethical hacker या security researcher नहीं बना सकते. Mm-hmm. What you can do is you can actually tell them certain boundary lines and certain precautions that this should not be done. Mm-hmm. And I, it's it's a ballpark figure, but मुझे अगर दे हफ्ते में दस messages आते हैं that their facebook account has been hacked those who say art are mostly females mm. and this is because of lack of awareness i think okay and, yeah so what do females do so i remember that if um, somebody told me also that jab aap apni image ko public karte the to kehte hain ki oh ye to phir you know hai hi logon ke dekhne ke liye to aapko issue nahi hona chahiye kisi ko bhi usko jo marzi kare bilkul so how how would you what is what are the tips like top 3 tips top 3 tips sabse pehle Uh, in, on social media, you should be very careful on who you're interacting with. अगर मैं किसी को अपने social circle में ला रहा हूँ, तो I should know about the person. Okay. And I should have, you know, complete information on who they are, what they are. अच्छा. ये सबसे जरूरी है, because in our friend lists, in our social profiles, जितने भी लोग होते हैं, the, the, if not 50, 40 percent of them are not known to us. और दैट इज दैट इज द प्रॉब्लम दिस यू नो जिसकी वजह से सारी चीजें होती हैं द फर्स्ट स्टेप इज टू एक्चुअली वैलिडेट योर सोशल सर्कल भाई हाउ व्हाट व्हाट पीपल आर इंटरैक्टिंग विद यू हु इज कमेंटिंग हु इज लाइकिंग योर पोस्ट हु इज सीइंग योर कंटेंट एंड स्टफ लाइक दैट द सेकंड मोस्ट इंपोर्टेंट थिंग इज शेयरिंग द राइट अमाउंट ऑफ इंफॉर्मेशन उसका मतलब ये होता है कि इफ यू आर पोस्टिंग अ फोटो और इफ यू आर चेकिंग इन समवेयर हम लोग करते हैं इट्स नॉट नॉट अ बैड यू यू शुड एक्चुअली नो नो टेक अ स्टेप बैक एंड अंडरस्टैंड इज़ दिस द इंफॉर्मेशन दैट आई वांट टू शेयर विद पीपल और और इज इज इट नॉट ऑफ़ कोर्स सोशल मीडिया का मकसद ही है कि लोगों को बताना व्हाट यू डूइंग बट इफ ऑफ कोर्स इफ इफ आई है वही मेरा पासवर्ड है So I'm I'm going to get hacked. It's it's very very obvious. Because mm-hmm. the first piece of information is that it's obvious. Date of birth, you know, mother's name, and all these things. So that that's that's kind of tip number three. To actually, little see the tips and to see the right information. Okay. 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 Okay.
secure yourself, to keep strong passwords, to share the right amount of information, to, to, to actually observe who is viewing your social profiles or what are you doing, what intention hai because you don't want anyone to see your information who, who has a malicious purpose. Okay, so now let's talk about the World Brand Project. Mm-hmm. If you are up for and how mm-hmm. do you plan on executing? Yeah, well, uh, currently I am going to start, I have actually started working on an initiative called Women in Cybersecurity. Okay. And I am soon to be involved with a lot of renowned organizations. I will collaborate with I will start the project and I will actually start to aware specifically women and girls how can you secure your online presence and how will you do that first and foremost i will do that by approaching the educational institutions okay. and try to incorporate a separate continuing education program course okay. in the entire curriculum how can they actually because if, if a girl is going to a university or job, you don't, you don't have to talk to strangers, you have to go where, where you're going and not, you know, not be biased or something like that. Yeah. So now we have to do things like that, but we have to actually make it on a broader level with respect. Mm-hmm. So, uh, on, on the internet, how can they secure themselves? How, which kind of links they should click or not, which kind of people, what is the behavior of a malicious person. Okay. So that's that's going to be an entire process that I'm going to Okay, start. so what about people like, uh, let's say Maya Omar does Women's Digital League and then I think Saad from i to i is also mm-hmm. doing something on you know digital skill development. Okay. Do you think that in those programs it should mm-hmm. be incorporated? Yes, um, I strongly think uh, about that and I have actually, I'm, I'm soon to meet Saad regarding okay. this entire venture okay. and I, I'm soon to discuss with him as well okay. because uh, I would rather work with someone who is already working in this uh, in this entire paradigm to start something from scratch. Okay. okay. Uh, this is something that is needed right now. Right. Or I strongly believe that if we educate our women on cyber security, it will be very helpful in educating our youth. They are aware of what's going on, but I don't know why there is a gap, a line between why should we not educate women regarding cyber security. Okay, so women cyber, so you know, cyber security for women is one part and training them is one part, mm-hmm. right? Making men understand the need is also equally important. Exactly, right? that is also important, and that is going to be a bigger of a challenge okay. than the than the previous one. Maybe so. Don't you think it'll help that you being a guy would m- maybe talk to more men about, especially younger men, uh, about why they need to be more careful about you know the kind of things they do. Well, uh, uh, they can if. I can't actually go to an, a malicious person and tell him that you don't need to do this. Most right. of the things that happen online, that the incidents <coughs> that happen with women are out of grudges or some kind of anger. So that, that I can't actually go to every person and tell them that this is wrong, this is morally wrong, you don't need to do this. is something that should be understandable by themselves or people don't need to do this. So the only thing we can probably do is tell women to, yeah, be, more to, to, to be more careful. Exactly. Because cheese uh, holding it online and people people are sometimes secure scared to report them mm-hmm. to uh, the relevant authorities mm-hmm. and if if they don't to be government kabhi to koi agenda tha na jis pe wo kehte hain ki aap hum phone kare and we will help you ha ah, government government is working on it but government can only help so much as jab tak aap unhe batayenge nahi ki problem kya hai ya kya ho gaya they can not help government is doing doing a very uh, good job but uh, the thing is that uh, I think that I as an individual can contribute to an extent where as per my capabilities. Until I don't go to the government, until I don't think that I have to do my own capacity. So that, that's, that's kind of my goal. Once I've utilized every capability, every capacity, every link I have, I'll do it. Okay, so that's the whole project. Yeah. Okay, so now let's talk about the future. He's asked, what recourse do we have vis-a-vis law in case our security has been breached? 
well you have uh, a couple of there's a there is a clause in the law called ETO i think so okay. so that that is actually a, a related to electronic security website security and stuff like that so you can look it up it's it's kind of old mm-hmm. and outdated but it is still uh, operational i think uska kisi ko fayda ho sakta hai like is your they i have not i have not actually seen a single uh, cyber case happening regarding a website or something like that mm-hmm. till now to be koi particular code or procedure chal raha hai stuff like that but there, there is a provision in the law that an eto is called eto and or agar case nahi chala to isliye kyunki log file nahi karte ya unko pata nahi file nahi karte because koi pata nahi hai na ki is there a provision in the law mm-hmm. ye nahi pata ki bhai if there is a provision in the law how can we access it how can we utilize the rights what is the proper procedure for reporting a cyber crime uh, regarding any e-commerce platform ya kisi website ke upar acha ha dekho na government ka to bahut sari aap hi rakhte hain cyber crime bill bhi aata hai what is your input on this entire cyber crime bill situation Have well it is it is uh, it is a good step it is a good start actually acha to uh, shape an entire law which will be forthcoming but a lot of people disagree with it i know i know but the, the thing is that like we're learning our government is also learning about these things so we cannot criticize on the fact that this something is happening और मैं आई अप्रिशिएट दी एफर्ट ये ये भी तो हो सकता था कि साइबर लॉ ना आता शुरू ही नहीं होता काम लेकिन बट एट लीस्ट पीपल आर सीइंग एंड क्रिटिसाइजिंग ताकि फिर उसके बाद आर गवर्नमेंट में रिलीव रिलीव ऑब्वियसली इंप्रूव दिस एंटायर ओके एंड व्हाट अबाउट इश्यूज लाइक जब लोग व्हाट्सएप पे पूछते हैं ना um, कि हम गवर्नमेंट के बारे में अगर कुछ लिखेंगे तो हम पकड़े जाएंगे हम ये होगा यू नो दीज आर थिंग्स दैट गो अराउंड हाउ ट्रू इज दैट कैन द गवर्नमेंट इवन ट्रैक डाउन एवरी सिंगल पर्सन व्हाट्सएप Right. So if you if you are someone which is a suspect and you are doing talking about something which is very very sensitive in terms of nature, okay. so you will be approached. Okay. So uh, that is some WhatsApp, social media, or Facebook, or any medium it is. Mm-hmm. So uh, that, that's why I say refrain from because अगर हम ही अपनी government के बारे में I'm 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 a very patriotic person by the way और what I believe is कि यार चलो हम अपनी government के बारे में पता है ठीक है बहुत सारे फ्लॉज हैं बहुत सारे प्रॉब्लम हैं गवर्नमेंट के साथ लेकिन व्हाई आर नॉट वी वर्किंग टू सॉल्व देम व्हाई आर वी ब्रैगिंग अबाउट इट ओके तो भाई काम करें ना आप जब तक खुद कुछ नहीं करते तो व्हाट विल हैपन ओके अम जस्ट अ सेकंड या ओके सो अम we spoke about the tips that you've given to women mm-hmm. and we've spoken about the issues when it comes to ethical hacking and cyber security for women yeah ab mujhe batao ki agar main female founder hu mm-hmm. theek hai aur mujhe kuch nahi pata law ke bare mein mujhe mm-hmm. bilkul nahi pata main ek tech company run kar rahi hu mm-hmm. uh, let's say you know i am a data sensitive person mm-hmm. i am collecting data and i am promoting that law acha what do i somebody you know like me or there are other women like me if they are a tech startup what do they need to do first uh that you see you actually asked me a question that which i have which in around which i based my startup uh, on okay i am my startup uh, which is which was previously known as cyfarm with me and it to vix i'll get to that why i renamed it mm-hmm. but the entire idea of the vix is to provide cyber security services and awareness to everyone okay and by everyone i mean every kind of business every kind okay. of organization okay. currently the entire focus for cyber security provision companies is on banks okay. and industrial controls okay these are the two sectors pakistan mein e-commerce ka ek bada rapid boom aa raha hai har koi apna business online leke ja raha hai फेसबुक पे इतने पेजेस हैं बिल्कुल फेसबुक पे इतने पेजेस हैं अब आप, आपके वेबसाइट छोटी-छोटी बन गई हैं इवन पीपल इवन पीपल आर सेलिंग ब्लडी फ्रूट्स ऑन दी या या तो बट द डेटा इज आल्सो देयर आप अगर किसी से कुछ खरीदते हैं यू गिव देम योर नेम योर एड्रेस योर क्रेडिट कार्ड नंबर मे बी एनआईसी तो दिस इज सेंसिटिव डेटा राइट सो अब जो बिजनेसेस हैं नॉट ओनली वुमेन मेन हर तरह के बच्चे लड़के दे आर ब्रिंगिंग देयर बिजनेस ऑनलाइन लेकिन then they are not aware of the cyber security consequences jo agar wo hack ho jate hain so the reason for me starting videx is to actually provide services to them in a manner ke bhai 
Of course, thanks to their security assessment and pen test for twenty thousand, thirty thousand dollars. एक बंदा जिसने अभी ऑनलाइन शॉप खोली है वो तो ये अफोर्ड नहीं कर सकता तो वो क्या करेगा फिर सो सो दैट्स व्हाई दैट्स दिस इज द एंटायर कांसेप्ट ऑफ वीडियोस आई एम प्रोवाइडिंग कॉस्ट इफेक्टिव सिक्योरिटी सॉल्यूशंस ओके टू दीस काइंड ऑफ बिजनेसेस ताकि उनके अपने बिजनेस के लिहाज से उनको सिक्योरिटी दी जाए एन एडिक्वेट अमाउंट ऑफ सिक्योरिटी ताकि उनको ज्यादा पैसा भी ना खर्च करना पड़े और उनको एडिक्वेट सर्विसेज भी मिल जाए करंटली मी एंड माय सेल्फ वी हैव अ टीम ऑफ फाइव पीपल व्हो आर टॉप नॉच अगर आपने आज ऑनलाइन शॉप खोली है और आपको ये ये डर ना हो यार ये अगर हैक हो गई और यू नो एक अनदर कंपनी का उन्होंने लगा दिया तो आप क्या करेंगे क्या गोल ऑफ वेरियस राइट नाउ टू प्रोवाइड सिक्योरिटी सर्विसेज टू अगर मैं किसी और को हैकर इंट्रोड्यूस करवाता हूँ तो डाउट आएंगे बट मी माई क्रेडिबिलिटी इज देयर आई हैव बिन you know mujhe organization ne recognize kiya hua acknowledge kiya hua that this is a good guy so you put your companies put their trust and faith in me okay. and i put my faith in my team right which is of course i have a, i have a team of 20 people and i'm not a one man show right right so, so i'm glad you said that because <laughs> this is a dialogue that you know i've i've, I've heard this conversation multiple times so i think it needs no no i think in the face of the company is me and my credibility is my company's credibility right which i of course i i had these the people that are working with me are sort of my apprentices so right. i trust them fully companies can trust me people can trust me no problems okay mm-hmm. acha uh, abhi aapne baat ki thi na data sensitivity ki aur mm-hmm. data sharing ki mm-hmm. so abhi e-commerce bahut sari informal ho rahi hai theek hai um aap cash on delivery pe log zyada tar kaam kar rahe hain acha wo bhi to ek issue hai because आपके घर को बंदा डिलीवरी देने ही आता है आपके ऑफिस को बंदा डिलीवरी देने आता है दैट इज वन पार्ट बट अब टेल मी कि ये जो अपेरेंटली यू नो पे पैल्स एंड ऑल दीज गेट वेज जिनके ऊपर काम हो रहा है हो तो रहा है बट हाउ डू पीपल लाइक यू कम इन टू द पिक्चर देन व्हेन व्हेन द स्ट्रक्चर इज बीइंग फॉर्म्ड हां तो देखें माय आई हैव एक्चुअली टू अप्रोचेस वन इज द प्रोएक्टिव अप्रोच साइबर सिक्योरिटी में दो ही अप्रोच proactive and reactive approach the proactive approach is building something based on a standard if you're building an e-commerce platform if you are u- utilizing secure coding standards if you're utilizing you know secure payment gateway standards so the chances of you getting hacked are reduced exponentially mm. while the other approach is the reactive approach ki bhai aap website aapne bana di ganda sa code likh ke when someone comes in us ne sql rejection ka attack lagaya and they dumps all your data us ko deep rakh diya then you think ke bhaiya now i have been attacked ab mujhe kuch specific karna hai theek hai and then they come in the reactive approach when you test when you have someone like me some company like me come in and test your assets and security okay then we fix your flaws and then you know we help you build the data thing back up again okay Fine. so thank you for your time just one one, one last note jee jee uh, For people who want to get in touch with you, yeah. how do they get in touch with you? If they're an SME or if they're an aspiring business or if they're an existing startup, how do they get in touch? With you? Well, I'm very easily approachable online. Now uh, you can type a message me on Facebook. You can email me at. Uh, I'll give you the email address which you can type in the comments. Yeah. And uh, there is there is no problem at all with getting in touch with me. I'm very easily approachable person. कोई भी मुझे कांटेक्ट करेगा इन टर्म्स ऑफ सिक्योरिटी इन टर्म्स ऑफ अरेंजिंग अ सेशन इन देयर यूनिवर्सिटी ओके आई वुड प्रेफर इफ इट्स यू नो फॉर यूनिवर्सिटी विद अ मेजॉरिटी ऑफ वुमेन ओके बट आई आई एम वेरी आई डू सेमिनार्स आई डू अ लॉट ऑफ सेमिनार्स एक्चुअली स्प्रेड अवेयरनेस रिगार्डिंग साइबर सिक्योरिटी आई एम वेरी इजीली अप्रोचेबल नो प्रॉब्लम एट ऑल 